meaning to you. So they are next to God. Without them, your life can never be meaningful. We are the one that elect the people. Are you saying Nigeria people are, they don't elect the people well? Or those people force them, impose themselves on us forcefully? In Nigeria, I don't think um, that we have ever got to the right, right from the inception of this country since from 1970. I don't think that we have gotten because um. Like the last local government election that just came now, you see most of the people that won the election, the majority of them are cultists. They have to say it. Because why I say so is that um, they have their leaders, they are lead them, and they are grouping another group of gangsters that will take over from them. If you see most of them that won that election, the majority of them are not graduates. They are all these big boys. And tell me such people that cannot manage their life as a people. Want to Let manage. Alone, you want to manage crowd. You can't manage your immediate family. Now they want to leave the whole local government for you to manage the life of your brother. How can you manage all this? So we have never got to right. But democracy is for the people. Nigeria is supposed to like, like, these people, who, the population of Nigeria is more than the people that are ruling. How do they manage to own a journey? Like, they hold us in captive. Okay, sir. The problem is that um, we have a few set of people that the government knows that they are the two peace. Unlike Ateke, Asari Dokubo, from Polo. These are the three peoples that are in this Niger Delta, South, South, and South. And they are the gatekeepers for these people. They know whenever they empower them, they will empower their voice, and the majority of us, there's no silence. That we can do about because they are the people that would have grown up and fight for we, the masses. But since they have empowered them, and there are few of their boys fight hard for them, let's do some other activity. So, based on that, there's nothing we can do. And even though we go out on protest, it is those boys that they have paid that will come at us. We are protesting the issues and they will kill us. No one will like it. So, that's the problem that we are having in the contract. So, the federal government is responsible for all the sponsoring people. At the detriment of Nigerians, they don't—they are not in touch with the realities of Nigerians. They are the problem of our country, and they are the people that are sponsoring those gatekeepers so that they will secure for them. And if any of them you want to wake up to challenge, maybe I take Akari or Tompolo, they will send their little little boys on the ground that and they smoke the person and tell you that they should go and smoke this person. And the next thing that they will come to you, they will tell you, hey, oh boy, he won't spoil my shopping. You no, know, so that they are where they from, they get my shopping. But you will not understand that this thing you are doing at the detriment of your own. And that's what is And the people as Adam Nigeria. So there's no way we can hold our government accountable. The only time that we can hold our government accountable is that these our brothers that are the case we to understand that the way that we are living in this society is not the way our life ought to be. And the life of our people and that of their brothers ought to improve more than this. When they come to realization, that's when we can grow as a people. But until then, we can never grow because they have given them the sugar. Few of them are enjoying the sugar and they are the case yeah. the problem that we are having. All right, man. Thank you so much for your time. Yeah. So what last message do you have for President Tinobu? Uh, the message that I have for President Tinobu is this, that President Tinobu, if you cannot restructure the country, you should go back to 1963 constitution. And I believe that was the first constitution. And at that time, Nigeria was growing at their own pace, which is the regional government. Yeah, yeah, Let them yeah. before they control their resources, what we have, and take little to the center. Yeah. That's my message. That's my answer. Thank you so much. So, I really appreciate it. Thank you. My man, I do too. Uh, thank you, thank you. And the evil spirit mm. and sad and said, Jesus, I know. Paul, I know. But who are you? My man, what's up, bro? Longest time. How are you doing? What is this? What is this? What is this? Your friends say no joy. They don't. They want to increase web traffic.